companionship with our little one. Let us cherish many memories that come to us at this time and that each of us propose to seek the Lord with all our hearts and to respond to the opportunity of salvation extended us through his grace. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life and whom shall I be afraid of? We then beseech you also that he see, receive not the grace of God in vain. For he said, I have heard thee in the time of accepted, and the day of salvation has occurred thee. Behold, now is the accepted hand. Behold, now is the day of salvation. Seek the Lord while he might be found. Call upon him while he is near. Earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Shall the judge of all the earth do right. We're going to have a prayer by our own brothers at this time. Let's pray. Eternal God, great and almighty, God our maker and our creator, Father, we come before you now asking, Father, that you'll bless this, this grieving family. Father, we pray you'll strengthen them. We pray you'll lift them up. Father, in this time we Father, ask you to help us to understand as best as we can where we go from here. And Father, while we can't understand why this life was taken, Father, we give you thanks for the life that you gave, the life that you shared with all of these who are present the life of Brother Hammerhead. Father, you gave him to them to love and to be loved. You gave him to be the inspiration that, Father, he has been to these that he touched. Father, you gave him to be that son, to be that uncle, to be that father, to be that husband. Father, to be that person that would touch all of these lives the way Father, you allow him to touch. So, Father, we thank you for giving him, for making him, and making him a part of all of these lives that loved him and yet love him now. Father, they need your help. Father, they need your strength. Father, we pray that you'll speak to them with that voice that only you can speak, that will bring healing in their hearts. Father's tough now. 
But Father, we know that it hurts because they loved him so much. Father, we pray that you'll have mercy on every heart that is here present. Father, strengthen them, lift them, and bless them, O oh God, as only you can. Father, I pray this prayer in your son Jesus' name. Amen. 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 This is in our Camilla service. We want you to know that the time that their the families in need is what they may feel. So don't forget them. Keep them in your prayers. Keep them in your thoughts. We understand that God is able to do anything but fail. I'm a part of this family too. My grandbaby Terry, that was her dad. She loved very much. And I've been knowing them now ahead for years. But we thank God for the privilege. I'm going to say to this mother and to this father that just hold on to God's unchanging hand. Because God is able. Now, as we give our benediction, we're going to come around and shake the family's hand. He made it. He repeated it. May the Lord, May the Lord watch between you, me and thee. Watch between me and thee. While we're out. While we're out. One from another. One from another. Amen. 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 Certainly we do give honor to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, giving honor to the pastors and the ministers who have gathered here today to show the family their love and support. To all of the other family and friends who have traveled near and far, this family would have me to render to you a heartfelt thank you. The last and certainly not least to this family, the Reverend said it best. Time is filled with swift transitions. Not on earth and move can stand. Build your hopes on things eternal. Hold to God's unchanging hand. Family, on behalf of the management and the staff of Rucker Funeral Home, we'd like to thank you for thinking enough of us to entrust him into our care. We pray that in the upcoming days, weeks, months, should you need us, call on us, and we are here ready to be to serve you. Your services just don't end here today, but they're forever going. At this time, those of you who still have roses in your hand, you're going to come around and deposit them here on the casket. You're not saying goodbye. You're saying good night. I will see you in the morning. At this time, I ask that you line up on this side of the tent. Come around, deposit your roses, and exit on this side. Thank you.
Shorty, 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 Step back that way. 